When you switch on the lights in a village home and open your door to the world, when you drink the finest tea from Bangladesh, when you cook lunch at home in urban Bangladesh using the finest quality of ingredients, when you apply that face mask when back from work, you know that it's all coming from the one most dependable brand in Bangladesh. Chorka Meena Sweets, KKT, Meena Bazaar or Meena Herbal. All part of a conglomerate that is one of the most visible and trusted brand names in Bangladesh. Gemcon Group. Gemcon, defining standards in innovation and services. The Gemcon Group of companies started its journey in 1982 with pioneering German technology to manufacture reinforced electric poles in Bangladesh. Under the brand Chorka, the company has manufactured millions of electric poles in its two factories, strategically located in Khulna and Ponchavar. With stringent quality control in raw materials and manufacturing processes, it has remained the market leader as the largest and most reliable electric pole brand in the country. Chorka has changed the way electricity is transported and with it changed the way of life in far corners of Bangladesh. Gemini Seafood is the seafood processing company that has been awarded the largest number of international standard certifications in Bangladesh. Gemini processes various kinds of shrimps and fish and exports them the world over. Since 1984, Gemini Seafood is one of the pioneering seafood processing plants that have remained in the forefront of adopting new technologies, processes, training and best practices. Though the northern districts of Bangladesh are famous for growing the finest jute in large quantities over decades, there was no jute processing facility around the region. In 2003, Gemcon Group had taken up an initiative to start Gemjute, the first jute mill in the north. With thousands of people working in every shift, Gemjute is the largest employing factory in the northern region. Incidentally, a majority of the workers here are women. The entire production of Hessian cloth, Hessian bags, gunny bags, canvas, ropes and yarns from Gemjute is exported. With a consistent double-digit production growth in Gemjute, the golden fibre of the north can only expect sunshine ahead. In the year 2000, in the barren and unknown tract of land in Tetulia, Gemcon Group planted KKT, the first organic tea in Bangladesh. Now, this plantation is perhaps the single largest organic tea estate in this part of the world. After this virgin land was acquired for tea plantation, thousands of tons of organic manure are applied every year to turn it into fertile and strictly organic soil. And the yield is the finest certified organic tea from Bangladesh that fetches the highest price in the auction houses year by year. The export brand of KKT, T. Tulia, has reached the four corners of the world within a few years of its production. KKT, carrying a cup of goodness. Set up in 2002, Mina Bazaar is now a way of life for a large number of urban Bangladeshis. Across different cities and many stores, Mina Bazaar has developed a strong trust factor between the brand and the urban families in Bangladesh. They shop at Meena Bazaar for their daily necessities. For the best of vegetables, for the purest of oil and ghee, for the freshest of fish, meat and eggs, for the cleanest and the choicest of spices, and for the best of food grains, these Bangladeshi urban families look no further. Dozens of expert hands check every onion and potato, and fresh vegetables are carefully sorted for the shelves of Meena Bazaar. Fresh catch of fish and meat gets ready for the outlet stores. 
the moisture content of food grains are checked and super clean pulses, rice and sugar are measured correctly and packed in Meena bags. Meena's own home brand also includes tissue paper, packaged drinking water and a variety of spices. Meena Bazaar is particularly famous for its organic brand of products. Apart from vegetables, rice, pulses, jaggery, oil, cheese, sweets and tea form an ever-increasing band of organic products on Meena Bazaar's teeming shelves. Started in 2003, Meena Herbal is perhaps the only authentic herbal product range from Bangladesh. It selects the purest of ingredients and applies the most honest methods to extract the best herbal treatments for your skin, hair and well-being. Meena Herbal brings you the best of nature. Its product range includes skin care, hair packs, scrubs and wellness products. All for a more beautiful you. Launched in 2011, Gemcon City is the youngest entrant in the property development business in Bangladesh. Gemcon City has already built its position as a company with a keen eye on built quality and architectural design. The company ensures meticulous quality control in both materials and construction processes. Gemcon City residential and commercial properties stand out on the value and quality matrix and have set a new benchmark in the property development sector. People of Bengal learned the trick of making cottage cheese or chana from the Portuguese settlers in Hooghly district. This chana became the main ingredient for making Bengali sweets that changed the taste and palate of the region forever. Our love for mishti was formalized in the 19th century, during the Bengal Renaissance, when the two most iconic sweets were invented, the Roshugulla and the Shondesh, both using chana. A Bengali artisan can do magic with chana. It is mixed with sugar and constantly stirred over a hot pan. Soon it turns into delicate shondish. Chana is kneaded and made into a small ball. The ball is then boiled in sugary syrup and turned into the celebrated roshugulla. The same ball can also be fried, first in oil, and then soaked in syrup to make the mouth-watering Lal Mohan. The chana ball is pressed gently. It is first boiled in syrup and then soaked in thickened milk, which turns the product into delicious Dood Malai. The same mix, when given a twist, fried and soaked in syrup, is wonderful chana jilipi. This amazing variety of delicacies is brought to you by Meena Sweets. Meena Sweets is an exercise in best practices. It maintains the best of traditions in the most modern, hygienic condition. The work shift starts with a vigorous compulsory hand wash. All the artisans wear face masks and clean uniforms. The workplace is air-conditioned to keep a check on the bacteria count. A non-reactive epoxy floor is cleaned every couple of hours and food technologists verify every ingredient in the modern in-house lab. Finally, the master artisans from across Bangladesh have come together to bring you an amazing variety of sweets that are available in all Mina Bazaar superstores. Luxury for your palate. Brought to you by Mina Sweets. It was in the year 2000 when the first tea saplings were planted in Tetulia. At the same time, people in Jemkon noticed widespread poverty in the region and a large number of people, particularly women, didn't have any gainful employment. The company worked out a unique symbiotic relationship with the community. And KSF, 
Kazi Shahid Foundation was born. KSF distributed milking cows among the women. In exchange, the organization got a portion of the milk and cow dung as repayment. KKT fertilized the land with the cow dung and that produced the best organic tea in Bangladesh. The milk produced the sweets. KSF now has thousands of members and the number is ever increasing. KSF has been able to bring in employment, livelihood, prosperity, education and, above all, happiness with its vision and innovative collective action. The journey is continuing.